Hi everyone, I'm K2. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to paint some more winter color. Let's get started. I've bought this mounted card from China. This is a half white paper mounted on an art card. It is already mounted and it's like uh, putting a matting on it, which is actually round and um, creating an interesting space for different type of composition. Today I'm going to paint some long tail tit with just ink. This is the first time I used this particular card. The cards that I used last year were from a stationery shop, not an art shop. And this one is from a renowned Chinese art shop in Beijing. I just bought it to give it a try. The long tail tit that I'm painting is the white fluffy kind that is common in Hokkaido. I've never seen it in real life, but I've seen a lot of images on Instagram and I find it very cute so I have decided to give it a try. The whole bird is pretty much like a snowball except for the wings and tail that are in black and white. And I'm painting another one here that look like they are huddling together. If you have been following my channel, this is a new way of painting a bird. I started off with a short beak and then I paint the hat with dots and then the eyes and then the wings. Now I'm painting a tree branches for the birds to perch on. There isn't any particular type of trees that I'm painting because in the winter when the snow falls and all the leaves are gone, leaving just the tree branches with the dry knots on it. The quality of this mounted rice paper card is pretty good. It feels like painting on some regular rice paper. Much better than the ones that I bought last year. The great thing about using this type of mounted rice paper card is that you can frame it right away. So it is great for giving away as a gift or for your own decoration and it's very cost-effective and efficient. And now I'm painting the long tail, which is in black and white. And the other tail is here. The outer flame looks like a matting, but it's actually flat. So technically I can paint out of the circle. Why not? If you can think out of the box, you can paint out of a box too. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and the new painting and happy holidays. I will see you in the next one.